Hey, Glove Squad, it's Friday. Once upon a time, there were five gay boys, but with the help of my lesbian counterpart, Nicole, they all work for me. My name is Sam. Hey, what's up, Glove Squad? You're looking so glabulous today. So this week, Sam wants us to tell you guys about a time that we were unable to forgive somebody. And I honestly have a few things that I could give to you guys. So I'll just go with this. Back in middle school, I was tormented. Seriously, like, every single day, I was called faggot, queer, gay bitch, whatever. Kids in middle school are the most ruthless kids that you'll ever experience, besides elementary. But it gets a little bit deeper when you get into middle school because you start understanding things more. But I kind of, me being the performer, was into like acting and dancing and I joined the cheerleading squad. <laughs> Maybe that was kind of my curse for middle school, but I will never forgive anybody in middle school for making my three years in middle school the like most hellacious years of my life, literally. Those kids were the meanest things ever. But you know what? When they came at me and were like, faggot, faggot, queer, queer, I was like, you know what? You're the one on the football team touching all the guys in the spandex pants while I'm with the girls on the cheerleading squads getting to lift them up in the air and my hand on their ass. So now what, bitch? So this week, we get to share with you guys some baby pictures of ours. Um, yeah, let's go venture upstairs into the Michigan house where my family lives where it's crazy and wild. This is me as a little baby boy. Aren't I the cutest thing ever? Duh. And this is me and my sister. Yes, I do have Rugrat pajamas on. Don't judge me. Don't judge me. Okay. That's me, my mom, and my sister at an amusement park. Yeah, my mom's pretty rad. Look at her rocking her tucked in tank top and her denim shorts. Me and my sister are chillin' again. Chillin' like villains, chillin' like villains. That's me as a pretty sickening child with Santa Claus. I mean, who isn't cool and doesn't go see Santa Claus? And from going to see Santa Claus to giving the graduation speech in high school, yay! Okay, 30 seconds, five questions, unedited, starts now, name one celebrity you would not want to smell. Ugh, Marilyn Manson. Not including yourself, which two glabs would you like to see have sex? Um, nobody! Um, three, who would you date from Jersey Shore? Polly D, of course. Four, if you were to get married, would you want to propose or be proposed to? Um, I'd want to get proposed to. Or proposed, doesn't matter, either or, doesn't matter. If the glab who's days before you were a drink, what drink would they be and why? One of those Mexican drinks, like you know a margarita, that'd be Nando because he's real Mexican, okay? <laughs> I want to give a big shout out to three people this week. Um, Jello1031, Hot Missy, or Missa, and it's Diana Sky for being frequent followers. Thank you so much for your amazing comments, and thank you to all the glab squad. You guys are amazing. Keep watching all the videos. Watch all of the glab videos. We love you guys. Keep tuning in. Bye. Glad Squad, if you've missed our other videos, what are you waiting for? Click and watch. <laughs>